You know? Okay. Javante Davis, Davis was, was arrested for domestic violence. Cops say Javante Davis roughed up a woman in Florida on a, two, on a Tuesday afternoon, uh, slipping, slapping her, slapping with, a her with a closed hand and leaving her with an abrasion on the inside of her uh, upper lip. According to the docs, the 28-year-old fighter uh, did, did actually, actually and intentionally touch and strike the woman against her will and did intentionally cause bodily harm to her. Davis was arrested about an hour after the alleged incident and booked on a domestic violence battery charge. Jail records show he's still in police custody. Davis is scheduled to fight Hector Luis Garcia in a much-anticipated boxing match on January 7th in Washington, D.C. Well, that's not happening. I mean... It's not going to happen, bro. He's yeah, not going to fight. That fight probably canceled. It, they, it, the fight's going to cancel in his sponsors. If he's fought... I mean, you can't find him guilty right now, but I'm assuming he's going to get a great lawyer. He has money. Do we know who the woman is? Because I saw some headlines that said baby mama. Hmm. And I probably, know what we just read didn't, didn't, uh, that, it wasn't that, that's, specific. That's what I thought it said, too. But uh, yeah, like yeah, yesterday, right, yeah. when the reports came out. And yeah. that's not even just a domestic violence. His hands are registered. His hands are considered deadly weapons. Right. So he is, is going to be considered, like, assault with a deadly weapon as well, mm -hmm. other than domestic violence. That's facts. And that never goes good for a boxer, ever. For it to be domestic violence, though, one thing that Flacco taught me in Suspects was that if it says domestic violence, then that's somebody that you were in a relationship with. You didn't know that? No. Yeah, that's what domestic does. <laughs> I did not know that. Fucking I thought <laughs> I thought domestic violence. I thought domestic violence just meant in the house. If it's just a female and a guy. Mm -mm. Oh, domestic, domestic violence is a video I went viral for. Wait, right? Josh. It could be domestic violence for dude on dude or female. That's what women. I thought. Yeah, yeah but if they're yeah. in a but intimate they're in a relationship, if it, if it has to be intimate, that's what, what about domestic what means. happens if it's a parent and a, someone younger in the house is that that's not child, no, that's, not child, that's, that's child that's child abuse. Abuse. abuse that's not domestic what if they're what, what if they're both adults that's oh then i think i think oh no no actually because mm, well, child abuse then that's a good point it's just yeah. assault I mean, it don't matter a, once you're an adult that that's your parent that's, that's no assault. but but that is a good question that Loki. That's kind i of promise like you i did not know that until flacco has said that that's i never even paid hell. that much attention to the damn definition i just thought that just me you know well, like you hit me right now i'm thinking that's but, but like, I'm funny, girl. But like if, if you <laughs> if you beat up one of your parents or grandparents, that's elder abuse. Fact. That's like ah, a whole okay, okay. So okay. Well, no, if your parent's thirty and you're fifteen, I and think you if get they're over like sixty, yeah, something, something like that. Some shit like yeah, you that. beat up your grandparent. That's crazy. Well, glad we got definitions out the way, y'all. So oh, oh, Tory Lanez oh, case ain't for definition. <laughs> oh, within home. So I guess yeah, that is domestic violence then. Typically, yeah. including the violent abuse of a spouse or a partner. Typically, but, but typically, which, typically, so it doesn't have to be. It could be so. Yeah. So, but, so what Flacco told y'all is not a hundred percent. It's accurate. because look, domestic. Here we go again, huh? Look, <laughs> domesticated means <laughs> like in your house. Mm -hmm. So domestic just means household, like a domesticated dog or domesticated uh, wolf. It just it's in your house. Okay. But it's usually so it's house violence. But but it's typically, more known typically. typically yeah. Fools beating up their bitch or bitches beating up their man or whatever. Yeah. But but if you're if you're above eighteen and your parent if your dad whoops your ass. That's tip. That's still classified as domestic violence. Well, it depends where it happens. Like if you get that squabble at a in liquor store, like it's just house it's just two grown ass violence. man squabbling Bobby at the liquor store. You. Right. But this foot beating up his baby mama is yeah, it's not looking good. I think it's that's that little man syndrome, bro. When niggas be under like five eight, they just be angry as fuck. Like they like. I swear to God, bro, Napoleon syndrome, bro. Little men, yeah. they do the most because yeah. they're short. I'm not. I'm not even finna do the most because I know I might hurt you. Mm -hmm. But a little nigga. He gonna tip you up. Yeah, but he's not a normal little person. That don't mean shit. But that's you. You gotta realize why he probably went to even go get them hands to compensate. He's five three. Is he five three? How tall is Javante Davis? I might be exaggerating. He's but five. he's little as shit. I think he's you like You don't five, gotta take five. me literal. Stop taking me literal when I be saying. No, no, shit. no. I get what you're saying, though. But like that nigga, like since... five six. I guarantee you, he went to go get them hands because niggas was bullying him in his neighborhood. So yeah. that, 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 that's like the same thing when you a police Damn. officer. Five, five. He's five five. Bro, you've yeah. been getting bullied on your block, so you go to the gym and get the ultimate squabble, and now anybody <laughs> say anything, you're going to punch the bitch. Well, you, you know, the the thing is with boxers, too, a lot of them have brain damage. What's that? CTE? CTE. That's C facts. 
So like they, they have a very right. short fuse. CTE they're, they're, would completely fuck your whole brain up. Has Mayweather or Canelo ever beat up their bitch or hit at them in any type of way? Mayweather I mean, the, wouldn't have CTE. He never gets punched. But he 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 for yeah, sure he definitely got his he, shit he for before. Show has it. But you not know. like the average fighter. Yes. So he never gets punched. That's but, like his thing. Nah, but it's like being untouchable. Javante Davis either. He's he's damn near he, undefeated. He's not Floyd though. Undefeated in boxing in 2022 ain't shit. But do you, do you ever ain't notice? Shit. You ever notice when you see in some somebody that's a boxer and you chopping it up with them there's like this disconnect at a certain point i've never cho- i've and never chopped it up with a boxer that i have and, and i've noticed that with people and even just even watching them get interviewed or even mma fighters you know like what box like the, the diaz brothers and stuff there's so many different examples of fools that you could tell they're not stupid that's fact but but they CTE, they it, seem like they're it, just a little you bit lose off. your track of thought really fast it's hard to concentrate it's hard to put thoughts together you'll forget shit all kind of shit like it really fuck with your head. Yeah. I love this like like doctor analytics and like observing it in a sense where like let's blame it on the fact that he's been shocked a couple times in his head. But that was lush. Yeah, I was, I'm not blaming it on it. But but, to, but that's like saying let's just like fucking OG Sue is a perfect example that if a bullet goes to Europe. Perfectly okay, you know what I mean? Yeah. So let's not point out the fact that he beat his bitch because she probably did some wild shit, or he probably was just mad, or it was a CTE. Hey, some bitches let's, need to get punched. Let's also <laughs> not act like we haven't seen him be aggressive with a woman in public before because there's a video this of him dragging... That's not what I'm saying. There's so. a video of him dragging her out of a basketball game. This is facts. There's a, can, that came can, out probably like I two or three a, years was ago. Was it a basketball game? It was like a, a kid's match. game. It was like something. It wasn't there like... There was in the crowd and he yeah. was definitely snatching her out uh-huh. the crowd for sure. For, who was the football player that kicked the girl in the, uh, for, by the elevator? Was that Tyreek Hill? Nigga, that was like Famous Dex. Or no, 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 no. no. <laughs> I was young boy. That was Famous Dex, nigga. It was a running back. It just happened. I think Tyreek there we go, right? Or not it just happened, but the, the video just surfaced, I think. Yes. Yeah, Ray Rice. Yeah. yeah. No, no, there was one that recently happened, the Jaguar. That's Tyreek Hill. Tyreek Hill's not on the Jaguars. No, no, no. No, for they call him the Jaguar. He's fast. Oh. That's what I know he's in the Dolphins. But he like kicked his bitch over by the elevator. Mm. No, and like no. he got suspended for a year. No, nah, bro, that was when you were playing Madden full against AD. I saw. <laughs> but let's just be honest, the fight with Ryan was supposed to happen, and now it might not happen because. Ryan's whole pers- persona is like a person of God, and then he can't. Ah. But that See, was, that, and then that, now we miss out on a good fucking generational fight, man. Because boxing is shit nowadays. It's you so, rarely see great fights. It's rare. It's, it's boxing definitely is rare. Trash it's definitely rare. Nigga. It's so crazy how like uh, this era of social media don't take shit serious because people was on there roasting him, saying that he copped out the fight because he didn't want to fight the dude. Literally, nigga said he beat his bitch <laughs> up so he could go to jail and not fight Ryan. <laughs> like Who what? Says that? <laughs> Like you come to that conclusion. I hope, also, I hope they do get also, a fight, though, because at the end of the day, guess what? Then it's like, hey, you want to beat up on a bitch? Well, try to beat up on me, motherfucker. That, like, creates such Ryan a don't even sound dude. like that, yeah, but yeah, I get what you're saying. That would be smart like, like, yeah, like, I'm defending women. Ryan's going to come out with a jo- with, with Josh behind him. But hit- <laughs> <laughs> Y'all better the, stop giving Josh the, shit. The captain's saying, oh, okay. I'm with Josh. He Thank got you, the- Dona. Yeah, I'm with Josh. Um, Piece of shit.